My dad might walk. He may get away with murder. No. No. Zach, that will never happen. Your, your father killed so many people, and the DA, they'll prove that. The DA's not gonna get a chance to prove a damn thing. If my dad's lawyers pull this off, then there's not gonna be a Satin Slayer case never gonna go to trial. So then it's not over. Your father can terrorize us all over again. My father has persuaded a panel of psychiatrists to testify on his behalf at the hearing today. And if the judge rules in his favor, he's not gonna spend one day in prison. No. Zach, no, they, they, they can't let him out. He can come after us again. The worst thing he's gonna have to face is life in a psych hospital. This, this can't happen, okay? He threatened to, to take Spike. He threatened to come after right. Spike. I didn't finish this the right way. I'm gonna finish it now. Okay, well, wait a minute. I'm coming with you. No, I have to you're come. not. No, Rachel's on her way to take care of Spike. I'm he's fixated you. on you and the boy. You stay right here. Ryan, hey, it's Kendall. It's, it's an emergency. Come over right now. Alexander came up with some scam to get out of going to prison. So Zach got angry and he just took off. What kind of scam? Too insane to stand trial or something like that. Anyway, Zach is so angry, so he took off after him. Ryan, listen to me. You know how deep this runs between Zach and his father. Can you please go and find him and make sure that right. Zach okay. is not the one behind bars, okay. please? All right. You stay with Kendall. You don't look so good. Are you all right? Is anybody all right today? Right. Dr. Wolf, what is this? What's happening? When I saw you in Vegas, you told me that killing my father would be the worst mistake of my life. That would haunt me forever. Well, the only thing that haunts me now is my father in there. You were wrong. Zach, revenge doesn't last. The guilt does. And that kind of guilt you can't shake. You know what I can't shake? The feeling that my father's gonna hurt the people we care about. That's what I can't shake. What? Zach. Zach, you okay? Yeah, fine. Hey, your father's mission is to drive us apart. And I'm here to show him that's impossible. Go home to our son. No, Zach, I won't. I want your father to see me by your side in that courtroom so that he knows no matter what he does, he can't tear us apart. He can't. He already tried. He tried. But we came out stronger than ever. His hate only made our love more powerful. And, give me a hand, because of you, we now have a beautiful <laughs> future that your father can never, ever touch. All right, Mrs. Slater. Let's show him. I'll be first in line to testify against that lying monster. I'd be so eager to take on Alex. That bastard destroyed my life and almost took yours. We have no idea who his next target's going to be. So what's with all the witnesses my dad has lined up? Exactly. Come here. They've run every test in the book and your father. They find him disoriented and coherent and totally withdrawn. They believe that he has dementia. It's an act. You know yeah, that, right? Yeah, it's an act. The problem is the court appointed psychiatrist goes along with their diagnosis. So what I'm going to do is motion for a stay until we get our own doctor here to prove that he's lucid enough to stand trial. What if it doesn't work? Well, if that motion for a stay is denied, then it's up to you. You're going to have to break your father. Let's go to Red Rock, Red Rock, Red Rock. Let's go to Red Rock and play all day. Let's go to Red Rock, Red Rock, Red Rock. Let's go to Red Rock and play all day.